On this Monday Morning Minute, we're going to talk about the Ventrac Tough Cut. We'll give you guys some operational tips and tricks, and I've got a special guest today, Tom from Ventrac Australia. Thanks, Aaron. Cheers, mate. Thanks for being here, Tom. He's going to help me out just in case I miss anything. So first of all, what is a Tough Cut? A tough Cut is what most people would consider a brush hog or a bush hog. Uh, just a slasher, mate. Okay. It goes on the front of a Ventrac, and it works really well because a Ventrac can drive in wet areas or on really steep hills where your only other option is using hand labor and string trimmers. Whipper snipper, mate. Really? A whipper snipper? Yeah, simple. S simple, he says. <laughs> I love Australia. <laughs> wow. Okay. And you don't want to do that. You don't want to use a string trimmer or a whipper snipper because that's just incredibly hard work. Yeah, hard yakka, mate. No one likes it. That's right. So without further ado, here's some essential tips and tricks for using the Ventrac Tough Cut. First thing, make sure your machine is full of gas. We use petrol, Aaron. All right, I'll give you that one. Once you're full of gas, load the machine up on your truck and trailer and head out to your site. Ute and trailer. Okay. Once you get there, check for any stumps, logs, rocks, utility poles, any obstructions that you might... Just have a good sticky beak. Right. So you're looking around for things that might cause damage to the machine if you get to them while you're mowing and you didn't see them. The next thing you want to do is make sure if you're on any hills that you're in low range. Make sure you move the machine into low range before you get on those hills. Also, make sure you have the machine in full weight transfer. One very important tip also if you're using dual wheels is that you have your pressures right. Make sure the inside tires are between 8 and 10 PSI and the outside tires are between 6 and 8 PSI for proper operation. Did I miss anything? Bit of safety helps, Aaron. Make sure you wear a seatbelt, PPE, and your ROPs are up. Thanks. It's a good, it's a good point, Tom. Make sure your safety's dialed in. So, now that we've covered those things, no matter where you're mowing in America, and Australia, and Australia, follow these tips and have a good time mowing. <laughs> <laughs>